So uh, new information about what's happening in Millersville after a series of city leaders were fired. The commission meeting devolved into chaos last night. Nikkel joins us to show us what happened. Hey, good morning. You know, last night, tensions were certainly high as the commission discussed the interim city manager's job, including how much she's paid. You know what? I don't trust you as far as I can throw you. I would like to have the room clear. No. Yeah, last night's meeting was just a snippet of the chaos that's ensued in the city so far this year. Since January, the commission has fired the city manager, the city attorney, the police chief and the fire chief. Last week, almost every firefighter in the city walked off the job. The city attorney told us the firings followed ongoing investigations. That includes an investigation into the chief's uh, issued cell phone. Now, people who are frustrated with what's going on blame the interim city manager, calling her unqualified. Several residents attended last night's meeting. You can see it was a packed city hall there, demanding answers and change. One man declared he was willing to pay to hold a special election to replace some of the commissioners. After the meeting, he told us he thinks a lot of the political issues in Millersville could bleed into surrounding areas. I would ask the communities that surround us to pay attention to what's going on in Millersville because what's going on in Millersville is coming to your community if you don't address it and you don't get involved and you don't support your area and help us any way that you can help us to be able to get rid of these people. Now, a vote to fire the interim city manager failed last night. On another three to two vote, the commission decided to pay the city manager $6,500 a month, but they didn't specify where that money would come from. Neil.